Hi, my name is Sue. I'm with Georgia Career Institute on behalf of Expert Village, and we're going to talk about freehand nail art today. Okay, now we're going to talk about the, the different polishes that we can use for nail art. Okay, first in polishing, you have a base coat. That is what you use to put on the nail first to protect the natural nail from the polish and from staining. Next, you'll go to the color, any kind of nail color. You have nail polish and nail lacquer. A lacquer is a thicker type of polish, so it stays on longer, has better coverage. You can buy nail OPI at any retailer, a salon, or you can get whatever you like to use at your local store. The OPI has a wide brush, so you get better coverage, and you can see the thickness of it. It's not runny like normal polishes. Now we'll move on to the stropper brushes. You can buy these, they range from $1.99 to about $3.99. You can get them in a variety of colors. They have neon colors to white and your basic white and black and gold. You use these for detailing, striping, any kind of fine lines that you'd have to use on nail art. Some more of the simpler kind of paints you can use for nail art, just your basic acrylic paints. These can be bought at any Walmart or Hobby Lobby or Michael store or any kind of craft store that you have in your area. When you buy these polishes, you also have to invest in a set of nail art brushes. If you take care of these brushes, they will last you for a long time. You can mix and match your own colors to make your special formula.